The World Health Organization has claimed that microplastics contained in drinking water does not pose any high risk to human health. Studies over the years have detected plastic particles in tapped and bottled water. Now, this has sparked major concerns among the public. Microplastics enter drinking water mainly through runoff and wastewater effluents. Now, but in the latest revelations, humans have nothing to worry about. Like that. Look at this. It's all pieces of microplastic in the future. So there's absolutely no doubt that, that microplastics are found in drinking water and indeed fresh water and um, water sources that lead into the drinking water like groundwater. Um, the studies we looked at, um, many of them actually characterized the particles and confirmed they were microplastics. So we are ingesting them. Now, when we think about the potential uh, risks that they pose and what pathways, there's the issue of a particle, an, an inert particle, so plastic doesn't chemically react, coming into the body and possibly causing harm in organs and tissues. And the, the main message is that the vast majority of microplastics would pass harmlessly through the body. Plastic pollution is so widespread in the environment that according to World Wildlife Fund, we may be ingesting five grams of pollution every week. Well, right now, there's 2 billion people in the world that are drinking fecally contaminated water, which is a staggering number, and there is almost 1 million deaths per year from um, diseases, uh, diarrheal disease, so from water or poor sanitation. Um, and so that, that's really what people need to focus on, especially in Africa and South Asia and places where there's um, you know, uh, um, insufficient or inadequate water supply and sanitation.